hello hello good evening everyone this is life issue and this is lesson okay please help me subscribe to my channel help me like help me drop your comments and i promise to always bring to you good content and things that you enjoy reading and hearing about okay this is an update on the story i carried like two days ago about pastor alpha luku who resurrected a dead man all right so story coming from south africa reveals that the man that he resurrected from the dead is called brighton and now the allegation of what people are saying is that he actually was not dead now oh, i don't know but that's what is coming up all right so brighton was arrested yesterday's morning and this is a report coming from citizen newspaper in south africa and it's alleged that brighton's former employer in an interview with azania mazoka um told the panel or the person that was interviewing them that brighton used to work for him as a wood worker so he used to work in a in a woodworking factory in pictoria in south africa and vincent who happens to be his former employer said that brighton actually had before done this kind of stunt before for pastor alpha that he once pretended to be on a wheelchair for the pastor to heal him all right so me i mean when i when i read this i was like oh my god i mean is this real where are we going to with christianity all right is the pastor aware of what is going on now from social media from a lot of pictures that i've seen online and a lot of you know people's comments people are, are also alleging that the brighton of the said dead man happens to be the pastor or one of the pastor's cameraman so i'm going to ask a question was this staged did the pastor not know did he know was the dead man paid for his stunt i don't know you decide okay i mean i'm not going to talk about christianity or talk about any religion or castigate any pastor at the end of the day when we meet our maker we will all answer for what we've done on x okay if pastors are fake I don't know if pastors are real I don't know all I know is I'm fighting my own cause every other person should fight their own cause but if this is real if this pastor actually paid Brighton to do this should the pastor not also be arrested should he not also face the consequences I know so many Christians will attack me will say yeah I know he didn't know or but the point is should he not be held responsible if this man was his cameraman has done something like this before how can unbelievers believe us if in Christendom hands are not upright all right so I'm gonna leave this for you and I've put the picture of Brighton and the pastor and I'm gonna leave this for you to George drop your comments okay all right so just giving you an update on the story hopefully the pastor will be arrested or everybody involved in this cover-up or in this manipulation will be arrested and as the story unfold i will keep everyone updated <laughs> thank you oh i was even thinking that when i died my husband would send me to him for him to resurrect me now oh my god well maybe we'll look for another messiah then 
all right love take care everyone have a lovely evening please help me subscribe please help me like and please drop your comments should the pastor go scot-free thank you bye bye